And high school students across the Quad Cities are learning the ropes of the medical field. It's all part of Genesis, Genesis Health System's mock trauma drill for students. News 8's Nina Burns shows us why some students say the pandemic is influencing their interest in medicine. It's new tonight at 5. So we're going to use a blunt needle. Recruiting the next generation of healthcare workers. As high school students take part in a mock trauma drill at the Genesis Medical Center in Davenport. And there are some things that I learned today that I didn't even know that they did with like trauma. Davenport West High School junior Kaylin Ruckolt says she's planned on entering the medical field since she was 10. And I plan to become a trauma surgeon in the future. So this camp is just a really great opportunity to get at least like the ground level and like the um, basics of like healthcare. Everybody had their parts to do in the place. Finding her passion around the same age is Rock Island High School sophomore, Sonia Pollard. I always wanted to be in the medical field. Like my mom, she's a nurse. So I was like, um, like she come home and tell me all these stories. But the pandemic has played a major role in both students' future career choices. How many people that have lost their jobs or like have left the medical field because of the pandemic and how it's been affected has definitely pushed me to want to become a trauma surgeon more because I want to be able to help people and I want to be able to take care of people. Opening Pollard's eyes to job security. I feel like it is really like all your hard work would really like just pay off. And with over 200 job openings system wide at Genesis Health System. There are so many jobs and opportunities within the medical field. And even when you're in college, you can always change your mind. Health systems will continue recruiting their next generation of employees. In Davenport, Nina Burns, WQED News 8. Unity Point Trinity will host its mock trauma drill program next week.